Good morning to you all. Julia, I am a girl of class 10C with my project mate because she was of class 10A. is going to present you our science exhibition project which is Mars Rover. Our project subject is Science with Fun. And the name of our mentors are Mrs. Neelam Joshi ma'am, Mrs. Mamta Tatkar ma'am and Mrs. Haya Fadima ma'am. So first of all, what is a rover? A rover or a planetary rover is planetary surface exploration device designed to move across the solid surface on a planet or other planetary masses celestial bodies. Some rovers have been designed as land vehicles to transport members of a human space flight crew. Others have been partially or fully autonomous rovers. Rovers are typically created to cool land on another planet older than Earth via a lander spacecraft tasked to collect information and about the terrain. So, what components we have used here? We have used an Audino Uno, an HC05 Bluetooth module, an L9 motor driver and 12 volt geared motors of 100 RPM of 6 pieces and 12 volt 6 ampere 6000 mAh lithium ion battery, a solar panel, a jumper wires and 12 volt DC fan and PVC pipes and 7, uh, 7 by 2 cm wheels of 6 pieces and IP camera and 4 phone and secondary IP cam and electrical wires. So, how does a mass rover work? So, there are basically the HC05 Bluetooth module which acts like an input signal which are formed by the phone as in Bluetooth waves. And the second, the audio is the component which processes the whole signals into the command and and at last when the audio processes the signal into the command and the car uh, it gives the command to the l 9 motor driver which produces the output by producing the command into the accordingly the motor should be running so it takes only 18 days to complete and make it functionally and there are also several errors coming in the audio code of the audio which are last fixed and 20th June and was successfully working finally. So, how it was made? First of all, we have cut the wine list with PVC pipe into the pieces with a correct measurement and then I have made holes as per the wiring adjustment by drilling on it and then I attached the clamps at the end of all the motors and of a PVC pipe. Then I just attached the 12 volt 100 rpm geared motors with the metal clamp at the end of the motor points of the PVC pipe. So, after the PVC segment, we have tested of the circuit board. After the whole PVC part, I have cut all the circuits and attached all the components with each other and the jumper wire. Then I inserted the code in all you know and just run the whole circuit with raw motor for testing and it works well. Then we have just set up all the electronic components. First, and finally attached all the electronic components on old CD drive case with the clean look. And we have just checked all the things going well or not. And it was clean and good setup. Then it was ready to fit in the main body. After that, I just installed the IP camera and attached to the audio circuit. After that, installing all the parts on the PVC body. I just installed all the parts in the PVC body including the electronic components and all that stuff. After installing the main electronic components board in the main PVC body, I just have to do wiring of its 12 volt supply accordingly. At last, I just changed the code as it was not working properly as per we needed for our project. So, I have installed an IP camera and a broken old phone so that we can see the live view of the broke cameras in the computer using the IP address. I have also ensured a humidity sensor so that we can check the humidity in the soil and the air and a thermometer so that it can check the temperature 
I will also install the home made anometer, which is a device to check the speed of the air and it can also charge the battery by the wind energy also. And at last, I just painted it with an acrylic and a spray paint. Those things